It's coming at you again and today something special. This is for our Scott Retroformer contest on our Facebook uh, YouTube group. Uh, unfortunately, Scotty B, um, one of us uh, Lego Transformer uh, creators, he passed away a couple months ago. So we decided to do um, a group challenge where you can't use ball joints because he has to use old school parts and old school uh, uh, joints. So we can't use anything, I think it was after 1992 or, so, or 98, I can't remember anyway. But you can uh, go to our uh, Facebook uh, group, the link is below, and you can join up if you haven't already and join us for the next challenge um, and see all the crazy creations that are there. Of course, also this instructions for this retro G1 uh, transformer are going to be available for our newsletter. So newsletter, if you're already in the building club, you will get this instruction file in their new PDF format. And if you are not, the link also below to join the club and you will get um, the instructions for this retro G1 toy Optimus Prime made in Lego. Um, so again, as I said, I did this for uh, an homage to the original toy and an homage to our and our 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 friend departed Scotty B. Um, so without further ado, this has kind of brought the the ten year old and me out, which is a very long time ago. So he's going to transform almost exactly like the original toy and have about the same articulation. You can see here we've got fists and a gun, which are going to go on just like the original toy. So you can see here we've got a nice rolling flat nose truck, very G1-ish, as you can see, straight out of the G1 toy. Straight out of 1982, 83, 84, whatever it was, whenever I got that for the first time when I was a kid. So without further ado, let's get to the transformation. So for transformation, it's going to be very much like the original G1 toy. And this guy in robot is going to stand about 8.5 inches tall. Um, so it's a little smaller than, of course, well, it's a lot smaller than my usual leader class with ball joints. So from here, you want to wiggle out the arms like that. At least this is how I used to transform my original when I was a kid. Pull out the arms first, like that. I want to go here and open the front of the cab, pull out the head, close the front of the cab, bring the head down, halfway there. This is a little different than the original toy. We're going to ratchet um, up and then we're going to kind of close in like this to lock it down. We're going to close our feet. And then these are two technique pins here. We're just going to pull the legs out. And then we're going to lock it down so he can't uh, fall back. And I like to do that just kind of rushing the legs. There we go. Lock them in. Then we're going to take our fists. And you can see it has a technique brick there so you can add other accessories if you want to make them and then I'm just going to pull those arms out a little bit more because they have some good variability there there we go and take the other gun uh, the other hand with the gun on it again put it on the jumper plate just like the original toy I think we had uh, the, in the original toy it was sockets these guys are studs obviously Oh, there it goes flying my gun across the room. Anyway, here is. Uh, I'll put him back there. Come back here. There you go. All right. So there, there he is. That is G1 Optimus Prime original toy in Lego for our Scott Retroformer contest on our Facebook page, check out below. Also, if you want instructions to build this nostalgic Optimus Prime, you can get them with our summer newsletter. Again, click the link below if you're not in the club already to join the club. And if you're in the club already, well, instructions are probably in your inbox as we speak in our new PDF file. Don't forget to check out all the other crazy creations that we do. Um, we're changing over all our um, instruction files to this new PDF format so you don't need LDD anymore 
um, to build. So they'll, you'll all get the same files, everybody now from now on. So you can just open the PDF on any device and get building. So, uh, yeah. Until next time, everyone. Hope this inspires you to build your own creations out of Lego and elsewhere. And rest in peace, Scotty B. We'll talk to you soon, everyone. Happy building and take care.